Well, ladies, you do get a little bit of Matthew McConaughey shirtless in this movie, but you also have to deal with some rather horrendous dentures. You win some, you lose some. Mud is written and directed by Jeff Nichols. It stars Matthew McConaughey, Ty Sheridan, Jacob Laughlin, Sam Shepard, Reese Witherspoon, Michael Shannon, amongst a lot of other people. There's a lot of people in this cast. This movie is about two teenage boys who find a man who is stranded on an island. You're not exactly sure why he's stranded. Is he stranded or is he there by choice? I'm not going to tell you why he's there because I want you to be able to experience this film without knowing that. Nevertheless, these two boys, one in particular, forge a really amazing friendship with this guy and try to help him find something that he is really searching for. This movie is one of the best movies I have seen all year and I am so glad that I went to see it this weekend because it finally came to my city. It's been all over the place. I've been hearing things about it from various festivals that it premiered at. This film is truly incredible. This film is written, directed, and acted with so much passion. This is one of those movies where, as you are watching it, at least with me anyway, I was so sucked into this world. Partway through this movie, I had that great revelation that I've only had a couple times during movies where you're sitting there and you realize, you remind yourself, wow, I'm currently watching a great movie. I can't wait to see what happens next. I love when that happens during a movie, and Mud is a film that is so carefully crafted. You can feel the passion coming through every frame of this movie, not just from the director and the writer who happens to be the same person, but from all of the actors as they contribute to this film. This is such a dramatic movie. It's also funny and very lighthearted at times, but it's a film that had a surprising amount of thrilling sequences that had me on the edge of my seat, and two performances in particular that are two of the best I've seen all year, and one of them is just from a boy. Ty Sheridan is so good in this film as this young kid who really starts to forge this bond with Mud, played by Matthew McConaughey. Now, these two characters and the way they interact in this movie was so remarkable to me, and yet it was so simple, because this movie carefully crafts different characters that you can see in real life. I can see that kid having that problem in real life because I remember I had problems like that when I was his age. But there are certain scenes in this movie where I have seen these types of scenes countless times in movies. Like for instance, a fight scene or an argument of some kind or anything like that. You've seen these a thousand times in movies. But here, these scenes that could be in other films and just be so passable are so riveting because you care about the people, the characters, and that's because they're so well written. And this film is so carefully directed with pristine cinematography that I was watching and just drooling at how great this film looked. And that's something I keep trying to emphasize in my reviews. Hollywood filmmakers out there, guys, you gotta have good characters. You gotta have characters that we can care about. You gotta make us like them. I mean, not just like them, you gotta make us really truly afraid about what could possibly happen to these guys because you want them to be okay despite the fact that they're fictional. And that's what Mud has. It has real characters that just seem so realistic. And that's a credit to these actors. Once again, Matthew McConaughey is on a terrific winning streak of performances. Killer Joe was incredible. Magic Mike, he was great. And here in Mud, he is just as good. And it's funny because I read an interview recently with McConaughey where he confirmed something that I've thought of all along. He said that he actually had like his publicists and agents and various people or whoever get him like almost every negative review ever written of something that he was a part of. And they read them all. And he apparently decided to change his career. And in doing so, that confirmed to me that what I do can actually help. <laughs> Telling you guys and other people what movies are good and what movies aren't, in my opinion, actually does help. Because this guy is doing freaking incredible. And now he's in Interstellar, directed by Christopher Nolan, coming out soon. And I can't wait to see what else this guy does. Because here, he is Oscar worthy. And I gotta say, the young kid, Ty Sheridan, I really do think he's Oscar worthy. He was so good in this film. It's one of the best young performances I've seen in a long time. Reese Witherspoon doesn't have a lot to do in this movie. Same with Michael Shannon. Sam Shepard is in the film and he doesn't have that much to do, but the roles that these characters fill are extremely important and what they do give to the film is very well done. Everyone in this movie is on point. The film is crafted beautifully. It's written with such care and precision. It has characters that are truly interesting and that you can really care about. Mud is one of the best films I've seen in a while. It's definitely one of the best films of the year. My only issue with the film is it might be a little too long, but I really think the filmmakers used the length of this film in the best way they possibly could to expand upon the characters and make them more fleshed out. I'm gonna give Mud an A. I strongly suggest seeing this movie. It is one of my favorite films so far this year, and I'm really glad to have seen this movie because I was like, man, there really hasn't been that many great movies so far this year, just uh, really Place Beyond the Pines. I like side effects and warm bodies quite a bit, but I want more. I want more films that are good like this that surprise me. 
Mud is one of them. Please check it out. So if you guys have seen the film, let me know what you thought below. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching. And if you like this, you can click right here and get stuckmanized.